Pastels and palms, dancers, and a hint of danger. Together they comprise the image of Miami, a city some have described as America's Casablanca. Of course, it's a Latin-flavored Casablanca. Cubans are by far Miami's largest ethnic group, which isn't surprising since the city is closer to Havana than to Florida's capital of Tallahassee. Some of those who arrived from Cuba in the Mariel Botillas a decade ago are blamed for Miami's crime and drug problems. But Miami still has its devotees. I know my impression of Miami is just a beautiful, romantic city. It's lovely. The weather is ideal. We they do have problems, of course, like any other big city, but I don't think it's any more than any big city in the country. Right, better bring them boys. The Mona Loca in there, Billy. What's going on, huh? Let's not waste no time. today i was like man fuck it i'm leaving anyways i'm gonna go paint you can suck a dick and that's it man 12 years later we're all still doing tattoos everybody's paid everybody's doing good and we're now traveling and doing graffiti it doesn't get any better than that <laughs>